Yes, welcome to each one of you, one by one by one by one. And Goranathara, Jasamoy Kandita, Sevarupa Devidasi, Parma Bhakti Devidasi, Saraswati in London. Back in London. Welcome back. And Leela Shakti Didi. And I'm sure I owe you a reply, but my obeisance is if I owe anybody a reply, please excuse me. I'm very bad. Very bad, very often. And Udaran Prabhu chatted today, Lavanyamoy Devirasi in the kitchen, doing her eternal service as plural. And Charu Damoda Prabhu, Charu Damoda, with Mother Jashoda and Krishna, and Mahaprabhu looking on, perhaps. Is it Mahaprabhu looking on? Not sure. Anyhow, to each of you, welcome. My obeisances to you all. And to all of those who may be seeing us in any other way, no, by recording perhaps. So, Devi Shishu, you've given a beautiful title as always. Continue your spiritual life with faith and integrity. Well, about that, faith and integrity and continuing our spiritual life, what is going to be the answer for what is the most valuable thing for us to continue our life with faith and integrity? Answer equals association. Really, association. We've, we've somehow received the seeds of devotional service. We've somehow got infected by devotional service, by the association of the devotees passively and a little more than passively through the, the books, but particularly then through the, the devotees who were meeting, rubbing shoulders with, and just no, noticing, unconsciously noticing by their example, the uh, enthusiasm, the sweetness, the behavior of the devotees whose hearts have become melted in that prospect of having a life of love with Krishna as given by our masters. So in the beginning, we've come to Krishna consciousness somehow through the contact with devotees. And so to keep our faith and integrity, we also need to keep the contact of devotees. So beginning, middle and forever, we want to be in association of devotees. And forever means wherever we will go, means if we are in one department, maybe we'll go to the, the Nabadeep of Krishna's, of, of Gauranga's world, or if we're with Krishna's department there from that particular grace, then we will be, find ourselves in the Loka Vrindavan of that other room of the topmost part of the spiritual world. Either place, everybody around us, including the trees, the bees, and everything else, will be devotees. And not only that, as Guru Maharaj points out, they, they're all senior to us. They can all teach us they're our well-wishers. So in the very beginning, we need the devotees. To keep us going, we need the devotees. And when we get there, we need the devotees. We'll be with the devotees. So while we have our devotees here doing whatever they're doing which happens to be i know reading Srimad bhagavatam right now and what are they reading mm. continuing from yesterday and i was reading yesterday with them ah yes okay i better not ask myself what they're reading we better ask them what they're reading and uh, so david shishra with your permission then we can go through and have association of the, the devotees here and see what happens Yes, Maharaj, absolutely. And I did tell I did tell them the title, but maybe David Shishru, you can be the, the first spokesman to say hello to them and uh, just remind them of the theme or whatever you like to do. I'm not saying what anybody should do, actually, but we do want we do want you all to be together and happily so. 
And Rupak is with us, our Bangladeshi Rupak. Hare Krishna Rupak. Welcome back to London. Are you in London? He is actually in London. Yeah, I, he was due to come. But maybe yes. not audio, perhaps. Just joined, so maybe, yeah, audio, not yet. All right. And iPad de Krishna. Krishna uses iPad. I tell oh. you, Android, Krishna, Android is so much better. You'll find it much better. Someone should give Krishna an Android tablet. <laughs> Hare Krishna. Sorry, Apple. Apple, you make wonderful computers, but I can't vote for your iPads. I'm sorry. Hare Krishna. Okay. Okay, we'll be very, we'll be very good. So we're in Guru Day's room. And the Nabadi corner, where we were, and now we're coming through to the devotees. Okay. Jai Shri Vilu Govinda Bhakta Vrinda Ki Jai. Jai Shri London and all over the place worldwide. Bhakta Vrinda Ki Jai. Jai. So these are the residents of the mat as of whatever the date today is, perhaps 16th of May 2022. Yes. And maybe everybody, uh, no, not everybody. Also there's Nirupama and two oh. children. Uh, who are staying here too. And so, we're going to put you here and Devashish Prabhu, you can say a few words and then we want our devotees here to be lively, energetic and generous to share words with you too. All right. Devashish Prabhu. <laughs> Dhanavat, everybody. So happy to see you all. And... Um, just in a few weeks, we I will be with you also by the grace of God, by the grace of Manindra Mahan Prabhu and Krishna Kantadiri and all of you. I'm very much looking forward to that. And uh, our, our theme tonight um, is continue your spiritual life with faith and integrity. And, and Maharaj just said a few words that the most important thing for our continuation of our spiritual life is association. And actually, we heard that so many times from Guru Maharaj. 99.9% .9 of your spiritual advancement will depend on your association. So, of course, association means with the devotees. But not only that. I mean, not only like who you rub shoulders with, but... Association means what you allow into your consciousness, what you associate with. So what we allow ourselves to be uh, influenced by or affected by um, the waves of the material world that are always um, bombarding us or whether we make ourselves, as Guru Day says, a good receiver of the, of the spiritual current. And that means to be humble and to be tolerant and to give honor to others, not to expect any respect or honor for ourselves. Then we can be a good receiver of that spiritual current. And Guru Dave also said, what we need is good friends. Good friends are very important for all of us. And, and Guru Dave said, uh, when I say that I want to be your friend, or when I say, when they ask me when I'm coming um, through the customs or immigration in the, and they ask me, why have you come here? I say to associate with my friends and their families. And he said, so when I say friend, this word in India is bandhu. So it is very heavy word. Bandhu means that I'm with you always, that when in the good times, I'm with you. And when you have no food, I'm with you to help feed your family. And when the, uh, when the, uh, the time of your death comes, I'm also there at your funeral pyre. I'll be there with you through the good, through the bad, everywhere. 
this is the meaning of friend. And Gurudev said, when I say friend, I want to be friends with you. This is what I mean. So this is the kind of relationship we want with the Vaishnavas, this type of friend relationship. Uh, that's really even more than family, blood family. It's real, it's real association, it's real family, it's, it's spiritual family, and it's what nurtures us. And now so much um, uh, controversy and so much um, disturbance coming in the environment, and we must be careful to guard our own spiritual integrity. And that means not to be critical of others. It is very difficult, but we are to try not to see the faults in others, whoever they may be and whatever they may be doing. Try to, Guru Maharaj would say, dive deep into the bright side of that person. And especially if they are Vaishnava, we must try to uh, keep an uh, honorable relationship with all the Vaishnavas a uh, respectful relationship with all the Vaishnavas and not to be a fault finder, not to be a fault finder or a criticizer or uh, any type of, um, uh, as Guru Maharaj would say, drain inspector. He said, when there's a beautiful flower garden on one side and on the opposite side, a garbage uh, heap, why you're giving so much attention to the garbage? and not looking to the beautiful flower garden. So Krishna consciousness is that beautiful flower garden, and we should save ourselves and save our, uh, our friends by um, giving our attention to that beautiful flower garden of Krishna consciousness. So we hear, you know, that Gadadhar Pandit, if anyone would make any criticism of any Vaishnava, he would immediately put his fingers in his ears and walk away from, from life. So we should also adopt that. We are not to hear criticism of others, and especially not of Vaishnavas, and we are also not to indulge in that criticism ourselves. Try to always see the good in all and the bright side of, of everyone and maintain the highest respect, even if they are not showing any respect to you. That should never be the criteria. But, who is, uh, Mahaprabhu has told us through Rupa Goswami, who, whoever has taken the name of Krishna, even once, we are to honor them in our mind as a Vaishnava. What to speak of those who are trying to uh, give their lives for the service of Krishna, then what type of honor and respect we should give to them, whatever their um, defects may be. So, Continue your spiritual life with faith and integrity. Take shelter of the Vaishnavas that you have faith and love for and, uh, and seek out their company and especially seek out the company of those who are uh, a higher type of Vaishnava than yourself. Then if you can get their association and it's that type of association, that means necessarily in the line of service to those Vaishnavas then we will make our lives perfect very easily. So this is my little um, contribution this evening. And I also want to hear um, something from, from the heart of you all, your devoted uh, feeling and thoughts. So thank you all very much. I'm all very happy to see you all and looking forward immensely to being with you all soon. Hare Krishna. Jai Devi Shish Prabhu Ki Jai. So Prabhu, we've got a room full of eloquent speakers on Krishna consciousness here. Yeah. And, we, and we see it comes out when the, the public come and the people who come again and again to the kiosk outside and who come to Vila Govinda here. So would you like to choose one or should we simply start with Bonindra Mohan Prabhu? And, and yes. <laughs> Just uh, just pick on anyone randomly. But Manindra Mahanpur is always a good place to start. 
<laughs> Definitely. And and Krishna Kanta, by the way, is hiding. I think the... I can see that, yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she's been everybody, Prabhu, everybody here is always so busy. And she's been gardening and she's got a pain in the back, is it, from gardening so much. Everybody's busy. Everyone, every devotee here. And this is actually one of the glories of Vila Govinda that when anyone will come. There is a an ashram full of service to engage in, just like in in Nabadi. Wonderful. So, I also have a pain in the back, but that's just from being lazy, not from oh, doing so. Oh dear. <laughs> we don't believe that, right? Okay. <laughs> Okay, yes, uh, the, the theme of the night is very, is very important for me and for all. And what you, you said is, is very true. And for people like me, we have to be really, really careful. Our Bhaktilata, our little plant of devotion is very fragile. And we have to take care and uh, protect from any danger first of all the apparada and nourish with the uh, water and 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 cow dung and try to yeah, preserve and make it growing if it's possible but not destroy it and uh, once madhusuna Maharaj said because we met uh, an old bamachari in in one temple in, in Italy, in Villa Vrindavan. And he stayed a little bit with us and, and Maharaj said, to, to be, uh, after many years, to be still be in the program of the devotee in the Krishna movement is already a qualification, which is very, very true. We saw so many fall on the path and for many, many reasons, so it's actually my prayer, pray, my personal prayer. Every morning, basically, I ask Guru, please let me uh, protect me and let me be engaged even today and allow me to be part of this Sankirtan movement in your, under your guidance and protection and give me service. And this is my personal prayer. And... Um, and uh, I have some fortune, no doubt, that the devotee tolerate me until now. So I'm going on. Very energetic tonight. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and I pass the microphone to Shanti Moy. Diamond in the front. Diamond in the front. to all of you. Well, it's very difficult to add anything substantial after hearing from Devashis Prabhu, Mrindu Mohan Prabhu. I can only say that, yes, those topics are always the focus of our daily practice. So it's really, thank you, Devashis, for everything you say. It's, it's, they're all good points to, you know, always remember it and keep it in mind, but also practicing them. And that's really what we're trying to do every single day. And as Muninda said, there are our prayers that we can really follow those principles. And yes, I wanted to say something else, but then I got blank. <laughs> it's Shanti Moy who particularly said, I want to see all the devotees. <laughs> but I didn't say I wanted to talk. <laughs> I say I wanted to hear from all of you. <laughs> <laughs> and who was it that said it it is your turn to speak this week the london group because we spoke last time who is that nadia sundari okay so here's nadia sundari she can <laughs> she can express her wish to you all it's done the what for everybody for because uh, also i don't know I think anyone from you, unfortunately, and we have very small pictures of you. So that's why it was interesting for me to 
uh, meet you, like to see you better and to hear something from you. Uh, so maybe it's my chance. <laughs> if I never will see you in London. <laughs> and many to come. <laughs> but, but you will meet face to face. David Schieffer was coming here. Yes, exactly. And, and some, some say, David Schieffer, that you're coming, you're coming back, you're coming to Italy to make sure I come back. <laughs> 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 yes, my aunt. that's true. But then you'll you'll have to come to Italy again to make sure I come back from London. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe I maybe I won't. Maybe you that's will try to keep you in. <laughs> you have to pay to put a deposit. <laughs> 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 Maharaj, we will keep your passport in the safe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she's hiding. Where's Sarasati? Oh, she's you. here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Waiting for you, Sarasati. You have plenty. Now it's our turn. <laughs> now it's our turn to have plenty. No. <laughs> you have to share. <laughs> you have to share Maharaj. You cannot keep him for long. We're not he's actually British. He's actually British, so he belongs here. <laughs> hey Krishna. We are, we do not identify with the body. <laughs> but this time, yes. <laughs> but we have also a representative of London. Yes. Right, you got Ananda Sarubin David Asi, who is on loan to be the Govind for a short time. And who everybody in London they giving a very good certificate to her for her for her savor and attitude. And we are happy to have here her here for this time. But put the microphone here then. Oh, yeah. I see. Oh, yeah. oh yes. 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 Thunderbolts, everyone. <laughs> um, I don't know what to say. <laughs> happy to see you all. Happy to hear you. I um, just feel very lucky to be here um, with Maharaj and all the devotees and engaged in Seva. And um, yeah, that's it. I feel, I feel very lucky because it's a full time program and it's nice not to have all these other distractions <laughs> in the, the world and life and blah, blah, blah. Um, so there's uh, always uh, hope and always a uh, always opportunity to um, try to go deeper and all the problems that we might think we have is comes up so we can try and I don't know what well, I'm talking for myself so I can try to uh, get, get better and improve and here is the perfect place for that no yeah nowhere else I mean in the temple like generally but nowhere else in the world can you I think, um, yeah, heal properly, like heal and deal with things in the way you can with the with all the full time devotees. So, so I just I feel very lucky for this opportunity, and yeah, I look forward to seeing you all again. And maybe she should coming soon. So yeah, big die and the end. <laughs> anyway. And we all thank the London devotees for teaching her how to cook so well. She was our cook today. Ah, very good. Yeah. Yes. It's actually me and John. You see, oh, no, actually, actually, you show, you show you. No, actually. oh, the Vaishnavas always give honor to other Vaishnavas. You see, you see. no, it wasn't me. But Munindra Prabhu has his, his stories of Gurudev giving honor to Krishna Kanta. <laughs> Would you like to tell a story? No, this is everyone knows. Uh, good, uh, keep uh, give our notification card, but with some reason. I'm not like envious. I little bit in the beginning, but it's uh, it's my fortune to be in her association. But uh, yes, it's true. Everything <laughs> I do, good. They wanna humble me down a little bit and and always praise Krishna Kanta. <laughs> 
But this, I, I did. No, no, okay, Shakata. So this little girl made everything wonderful, Italian mission, this and that. But I, you know, <laughs> I'm also here. <laughs> 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 but Moninjo also, you know, he, when he told me first, oh, this is my book. When he told me first, he said, but Gurudev, while he's saying this, and they're both sitting in front of Gurudev, and then Gurudev, while he's saying it, Moninjo is saying, but Gurudev keeps on looking at me from the corner of his eye to see my reaction <laughs> that, he, that she's giving all honor to Krishna Kant. And seeing my reaction, I think Gurudev, he does, he knows everything, by the way. I mean, Srila Gurudev really does know everything. There's nothing you can conceal from him. So anyway, but here we are, Nanda Sarupini Devidasi saying, no, it's not me who's a good cook. She's sharing that glorification with others. So exemplary. And we have with us here, temporarily so maybe because she's actually oh she's got one more day with us visiting from israel and so perhaps we can hear a few words from uh, from Braja sundri david Asi. and she's she's a very good organizer she organizes lots of things including the current series that's been going on since october of the holy talks of uh, bhagavad gita with uh, mahayogi prabhu um who'd given so much assistance, <clears throat> excuse me, to Goswami Maharaj in producing the books from San Jose, the classic books of Sashu Sri Krishna, Sri Guru and His Grace, and Golden Volcano, plus, plus, plus. And uh, anyway, uh, she's also a simultaneous translator to Russian. So very, very smart person here. And so here's Raja Sundri. She can say a few words. From the world, I can't just see. Can you adjust it so that nicely is showing? To, to, to? Mm -hmm. put, put the microphone near you, please. Dandavat, uh, Hare Krishna. My name is Rajasundari Devadasi. I'm from Israel, and Maharaj said about me too many good words. <laughs> I'm not so smart. I'm not a good translator. Everything is, and I'm not a good organizer. Everything is by the mercy of Srila Gurudev. Um, actually, uh, I need to speak about um, integrity, sincerity, about what? Maintaining one's faith with integrity. But you can mm -hmm. speak as you like. You are okay. with the devotees. Uh, actually, actually, I don't have a um, um, uh, rich uh, spiritual experience. I can uh, share with you only uh, my, um, my how, how to say, what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I want to say that all the time when I'm trying to make some service and I'm trying to do it sincere, all the time I catch in some thoughts which are looking for some benefits of every service. And so I'm thinking, oh, so it is my service is not sincere because I can have such a benefit and here I can get something and here I can get something. And I don't know what to do with it, but I understand that maybe all this just my mind plays some games and I simply need to continue my service and not to think about it. <laughs> and um, actually I have a question about what Devashish Prabhu said, uh, because he said that we need not to criticize also ourselves and to think also about flowers in ourselves. Simply as far as I remember, usually we hear that we need to, to look for some bad qualities inside our, us and not to praise ourselves. So can you please explain what do you mean exactly? Please. I think maybe um, it was a bit of a misunderstanding. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't say that we shouldn't find fault with ourselves. Uh -huh. In fact, Srila Gurudev used to say, my religion is finding fault with myself. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So yes, we should look at our own faults. And that should be enough for us for our entire life. Mm -hmm. To deal with our own faults is more than enough. And in other words, then we don't need to look at others' faults because our own are enough. You know, as Lord Jesus said, 
Prabhu, they, we, Lord Jesus said, brother, why are you looking mm -hmm. at, at the speck of dirt in your brother's eye when you have a plank in your own? So that is very good advice. When we have so much fault with ourselves, how can we take time to look at the faults of others? Then really, our own faults are enough for us for this life and maybe many lifetimes. And, and just reflecting on what you said, that when you're trying to do some service, you see, oh, I have some ulter ulterior motive coming up in my consciousness. Well, that actually means that you are sincere because you're seeing that in yourself and you, and you want to rectify that. The, there's one um, uh, Roman philosopher whose name escapes me now, but he said, the greatest fault is to think that we have none. <laughs> you understand? So at least we should see that, you know, my faults are so, are countless. But, uh, and, and so I have to work on those faults. But not, we don't need to work on those faults separately from practicing Krishna consciousness. That practicing Krishna consciousness will help us to eliminate those faults. It's like if you ever made ghee. Did you ever, have you ever made ghee? Ghee. What? Ghee, ghee means yes, butter, yes, yes, butter yes. oil. Yes, yes, so yes. If you make from butter, you very slowly heat the butter. And as it's, as it's becoming pure, all of the impurities, they rise to the surface of the, of the liquid. And you have to skim off those impurities. And you, it's a process. You have to keep doing it until there's no impurities left so that's actually our process that that's called um uh what's it called <laughs> anarta nibriti anarta nibriti so anarta arta means uh um to uh worship arta to worship and serve and anarta means what is against uh, us serving. That means our own internal um, response, which turns us away from the service of the Lord. That's called anarta. And anarta nibriti means the process of constantly bringing those, uh, bringing those impurities to the surface and dealing with them and disposing of them. In homeopathic medicine, is that's called the law of cure. So, in uh, according to the you know the uh, philosophy of homeopathy, before your disease gets better, it must get worse. In other words, what the, is the difference? It, allopathic medicine, you know, like that you get from the doctor, it deals with the symptom. So you have some symptom. It pushes it inside so that you don't, you don't need to deal with that anymore. It, it covers it up, it pushes it in. But homeopathy means that the symptom will become worse when it comes to the, to the front. And when it comes to the front, then you can deal with it. That means you're actually getting better. It's called the law of cure. So similarly in Krishna consciousness, all of those impurities all of our disease that we've pushed down in deep with inside us our spiritual disease if you like that comes to the surface and sometimes we confront things within us that we never even realized were there oh i never thought like that before i became a devotee where is this coming from it was there it was just pushed down it was just hidden and now by the process of krishna consciousness that's coming to the surface so now you have to deal with it. And if you don't deal with it, it'll, it'll go back down again, but it'll keep coming to the front until you do deal with it. And this is all part of the process of purification in Krishna consciousness. And really, if I said we shouldn't look for the fault in ourselves, I think I said, I think what I said was, we shouldn't look for faults ourselves, perhaps. But um, 
No, we should. We should see the faults in ourselves. We should see them acutely and, and try our very best to deal with them and always be, you know, actually we should be remorseful about our um, anti-devotional nature. And, and that will be healthy for us because it means that we have identified something within us that we need to deal with. And, and we deal with that through the practice of Krishna consciousness and through the purifying association of the Vaishnavas. They will help us to deal with those uh, impurities, those offenses, those anartas that arise within us. So I hope that's you know, clarified what I said, and I'm sorry if there was any misunderstanding. Jai. And, oh, we over time here, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, we're a little over time here, but maybe, no, okay, I've got a shaking head. <laughs> I, I, was a, I was about to volunteer a shining silver devotee that he wishes he wishes to remain anonymous so i won't i won't mention his name <laughs> and I, I let me tell you something about madurananda Prabhu. Uh, oh you're mentioning his name okay. yes because it's very obvious who you were talking about <laughs> madurananda Prabhu makes the best sourdough bread in the world Oh, yeah. And I expect oh, no, to no. I expect to have that when I come. <laughs> uh, now Krishna Kanta made it the best. Uh, <laughs> Krishna, now Krishna Kanta made it the best bread. Make it okay. Okay, the okay. I shall try both, and you and and I'll make a judgment. <laughs> and this this is the this is uh, by the title the London program. But you know who's got the certificate for the best English, the best uh, English accent, I mean, speaking English? It's actually Maduro Nanda Prabhu. <laughs> and this is from Brindavan Chandra. He just loves his English. And we all do, because it's got that it Italian life plus the English behind it. And Brindavan Chandra loves it. So it's a shame we don't get to hear more of it on the Zoom. <laughs> Hare Krishna. Bhimal Krishna, would you like to say a couple of words to all of the, the family of devotees around the world? But maybe a little short because actually we're over time here in Italy, as you know, we're, we're a little over time. But a couple of words from Bhimal Krishna, because he's a soldier. We, find, <laughs> we found that out. Yeah. Uh, nice to meet you, Devashish uh, Prabhu. I, I think we met uh, almost a year ago on Zoom briefly. <laughs> My, my old name was uh, Varun. Okay, yes, I remember, yes. So, but, uh, but Mother Susan Maharaj blessed me with the Harinam initiation and gave me uh, the name Bhimal Krishna. Very uh, nice. I, How but fortunate I can't, you are. Yes, yes. So I, I, just to keep it short, I'm, I'm just... Uh, I actually feel foolish whenever I, I need to speak in front of uh, Maharaj and the senior Vaishnavas here. So I'll just... I'll just say I feel very fortunate. Um, the, you know, I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. So they've really been guiding me and having mercy on me along with the other devotees here. So I, you know, I'm just very grateful for being in their presence. And what you just said about association completely clicked because I, I don't know, I can't put it into words what, I, what I'm going through each day. But it's, uh, but I think you described it well. So uh, you know, I think I thank you for your inspirational talks as well, and I'm grateful for the Vaishnavas here, and I look forward to meeting you in a few weeks. Jai Gurudev, also. Jai. Okay, cool. Thank you very much. So everyone didn't speak this week, but that gives an opportunity next week to hear from those who were so quiet today. <laughs> so, anyhow. To all of you there in London, you can say, oh, not only London, we're saying London, but actually from Norway, South Africa, from Ireland, from uh, Russia, Brazil, 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 and from America, from uh, Spain, and from Latin.
Latvia and other places. <laughs> then, oh, Florida. Well, it's all part of America. <laughs> Florida and Texas. <laughs> and to each of you. Anyway, you can see the family here. And they're no doubt giving obeisances to you and appreciating being able to see you. That's why we came in to show our devotees, the devotees here to you and you to the devotees here, or we, which both ways around. Maharaj, can I quickly say something? Yes. Maharaj? Yes. Okay, okay, but I'll come through and say quick, something quick, quick, because. Yes, yes, a quick in front of the devotees because recently. Oh. Andita came back from Italy and she gave us an amazing report of her trip, how inspiring it was to be oh. with you all. And uh, you know, it was amazing her, her experience there. And everyone is doing so much service and very dedicated and wonderful. She spoke very nicely also of the uh, Hungarian devotees there. <laughs> And we had Take beautiful Kirtan and Sankirtan program with her in the street, yes. in the festival. We yeah. follow all your programs. Very, very beautiful. You are very Rasvati, fortunate. come and see it with your eyes. You were saying about the Ukraine. After, after you visit here. Remember? <laughs> oh, you come on. I have been there so many times. You haven't been here. I know, I know. <laughs> I know I, I don't sleep at night because of that. <laughs> yes. I, I really hope I, I would love to come. I do. I just I have very few devotees here. So maybe you can send a few here and I can go there. <laughs> yes, maybe. Why not? We are not trading. <laughs> <laughs> we can do it. Very okay, very soon, people. very soon they will have enough of Krishna Kanta. They they will escape everybody one by one. <laughs> then they will come to London, take shelter in Sarasvati Didi. <laughs> well, Sarasvati Didi, I can yeah. also say that maybe I I'm very bad with the, knowing the number of months and days and things, but maybe three months ago. Then they're working away, making this an extra room on the top here, this, that, and the other, and saying, well, we're making all these space for devotees, but we need devotees to be here. And we're thinking, well, I wonder when that will happen, you know, that more and more devotees will come. And then suddenly Krishna's filled up all the, the rooms, the beds in the dormitories and everything, like all of a sudden. So it reminds me like in London, and you're also wanting to do some extension upstairs. You're making arrangement for so many to come, but in a moment you may just have like lots of devotees and a beautiful, beautiful atmosphere there for, for the visitors to come to see also when there are lots of devotees. It's so nourishing for the for the visitors. I think it has something to do with you being there, Manas. Exactly. That's precisely what I was going to say. You are like a magnet. So ho ho ho. Okay, okay. You can confirm that. You've done you've done your duty. You said those things. Okay. Now we'll move on to reality. <laughs> and I can, okay, and I must say, I mean, really, and it is a fact, it's not anything to do with me that the ashram runs as it does. When I came here, it is running really very much like Navadeep. It is so, so kind of just sweet, clean, clear, the whole, I, the whole kind of mood. Everybody, the Mongolati, everybody, evening Aarti, Prasharam together, do some service. And going on happily and if we don't have a morning program or an evening program we feel like we're fasting so we hope that everybody can have that feel and wherever the devotees are in different places can somehow come together as much as possible on zoom but when you can with the other with other devotees in your community and as one devotee one good devotee said to me when we were went for a, a program and this was actually in Beijing, in China, and this very, very respectable um, devotee there. Uh, he arranged a nice program with respectable people, and I asked him, so you know who I'm going to talk to, you give me some idea what will be suitable for them. And he just told me, I don't care what you say, 
just make somebody a devotee. I need association. <laughs> that was his guideline. So if you don't have any devotees near you, then make some devotees and make association. This is, this is the advice of, not myself, but this is the advice of that devotee. And I'm just trying to remember his name instead of just that devotee, but I do remember him very clearly. Only it were that simple. If only it were that simple. Anyway, please, each of you give some good wishes to the, some Vaishnavata to the devotees here. And please hear, everybody give some Vaishnavata to the devotees there all over the world gathered in the London temple today. So Jai Shri gathered back to Vrinda Ki Jai, Jai Shri Vila Govinda back to Vrinda Ki Jai, Shri Hari Nam Sankitan Ki Jai. Jai. Anyway, we've kind of held them up for their evening program because they should have finished 20 minutes ago. So my fault, causing suffering to the devotees. So they have to wait for their prasadam. Oh dear. So I'll go through with you just now and we'll be together uh, just next door. So just give me a, se a second as I go through and we'll jai. be there. Jai. 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 All the devotees. Ki jai. jai. Banchaka. Banchaka. Hare Krishna. Okay, so we are going to walk through next door. Govinda, Govinda, Govinda. But I have the challenge. I got to, I got to stand up. Yeah, no. <laughs> I understand that challenge very well, man. Krishna, 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 Krishna. Okay. And as we're here, as we're here, and then the outside world. Oh, I can, can you pass one at the front, please? Okay. Better make sure we don't lose our internet connection. So I'll just take you, because it's a beautiful evening in Italy, and who is at the center of everything is Srila Gurudev and Srila Guru Maharaj. So here's Srila Gurudev's Pushpa Samadhi in the evening time with the sun. Yes, it's a clear sky, so the sun has actually gone down. But it's the junction between day and night, Sandhya. So I don't know, can you see? Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. So it's not as, oh, the sun is still up because now the tops of the mountains are in the sun. Let me show you the mountains. I know they don't look very big on the screen, but there you are. Can you see behind? Can you see mountains? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, they look small, don't they? But Believe me, they're not so small when you walk up. <laughs> we've, we've, been, we've been up these ones in the distance. <laughs> but they're a little distance away, so you don't see them. But the sun is shining on the top of the mountains and is heading off across the Atlantic to our American friends and the ashram outside. Okay, we'll go in just to, to finish up. Oh, I can show you. Look at these roses. And one week ago, we maybe had one or two roses starting. And what a, an amazing feat of nature. Mm. Well, try and hold it steady. It's just completely covered with roses. So spring has come. And for the last three days, basically, Summer has come as well. I'm sorry, it's probably raining in London, isn't it? I'm making you. No, off. actually, it's a very nice day today. All right. All right. So, coming indoors. So now they're going to take prashada and it's just us together.
Anyway, any question from anyone? We had, we had a, a, a little bit of a different program today, but happily with the devotees here. <clears throat> but any question from anybody or any contribution? I mean, something to say, something to, to, uh, to share. Krishna Mahini from Spain, yes. Hare Krishna, Dana, Dana, Hare Krishna, Dana, okay, so beautiful. Yes, the ashram is beautiful and devotees everywhere are beautiful. This is awesome. A fact of life is that the devotees are beautiful everywhere. Devotees are different from the ordinary, ordinary people of the world. Hare Krishna. Somebody speak. Somebody speak. Seva Rupa Devirasi. Okay, please speak. Okay, Pandita, she beat you to it. If it's a, if it was a game and these games where you press the buzzer first, Pandita Devirasi. A couple of words and Seva Rupa did a couple of words and then let us continue our uh, what is our the title our enthusiastic maintenance of spiritual life. Continue your spiritual life with faith and integrity. Yes. Rasamoy Pandita. Sandavan Maharaj, Sandavan everybody. I'd love to hear uh, what Seva Rupa Didi has to say, but I, I just, if, if you're asking uh, to say, for me to say something or to add, it's like really true that um, the association of the Vaishnavas at Vila Govinda and also in London and in all the temples of <laughs> the mission is really the most inspiring, beautiful, nourishing, invigorating, <laughs> uh, <laughs> beautiful thing uh, uh, to, to happen. And it always uh, gives us so much strength to, to um, view things with a different perspective, with a fresh perspective and gives energy to keep going on this path and to try to stay strong and to nourish that little bhakti lata that we want to protect with all our effort. So I'm just uh, vouching <laughs> for that. And um, yeah, very, and it's very, very lovely. This is such a lovely Zoom to see everyone and to hear a little bit from everyone, it's uh, very sweet. So very grateful. <laughs> Jai. And I think everyone's nodding in their heart and saying we're very grateful. And you know, before the COVID and well lockdown, we're visiting so many temples. And when we came here, we're expecting to be visiting and passing through also, but COVID changed things. And wherever we went, always we feel like here we are, we're at home, we're not in, like we said just now, we're not in China or not in this place or that place. We're simply with devotees. So devotees make a place. We can have a wonderful place, but with not, without devotees, it's, it's even dirty. We see in India some of those places which look very nice, but what do they use for? Like gaudy uh, weddings where people are drinking and like, just wasting money and doing all sorts of things and then we kind of feel very unhappy in those places however nice they look and we see it has wrong mood it's not the family mood but we may go to somewhere very simple but the devotees are there and then it is opulent because of that Yes, Raj. And if I may add that really the Zoom programs have been an absolute lifesaver through the COVID period. But I would like to say that uh, having the opportunity for full immersion at the temple and sort of like uh, association of the Vaishnavas 24-7 is, is absolutely invaluable. And it, I'm inspired by what Udaran Prabhu said that like take that opportunity to have the association of, of the uh, devotees at the temple. We're so lucky if we have a, a temple near us, you know, a, 
one that Gurudev, you know, one of Gurudev's homes that such a beautiful opportunity not to miss out on. Enjoy. Thank you. And and it is waiting to hear from you. So we're going to listen in. <laughs> Dandavans. Dandavans. Um, I don't even have much to say. And then just listening to all of you and um, yeah, I'm like enjoying the class so much um, and yeah, relishing on it what everybody's contributions are. And uh, I think what I could just say is that um, definitely uh, the devotees, I mean, there's no other way that um, I could be like immersed in Krishna consciousness or knowing what to read or what shlokas or what to learn. And it's definitely through guru through the devotees and um, I think the association with the devotees it's like timeless if I could say it that way because you know I, I if I go to work and that and it's like a full day you feel like you can't wait until you could you know come and join the zoom or uh, I think I stay about an hour's drive away from the temple but even engaging in uh, in temple service and being with the devotees um, real life um, yeah it makes the world of difference it just gives you the um, it like gives you life I could say but I'm waiting for the opportunity where I could yes come and visit and meet everybody um, so yeah praying for that day to come but uh, I'm enjoy. I mean, I'm really grateful for all the Zoom and for being in everyone's association. Hare Krishna, Govinda, Govinda, Hare Govinda. Hare Krishna. So, Devashish Prabhu, I better not delay all the London devotees from having their evening brush out of two. I delayed all the Vila Govinda devotees. Oh, we did it together. Well, we all must take some responsibility. <laughs> we'll survive. They'll survive. Everyone will survive. And and all nourished uh, as a result of that. Yeah, I think. So I'm always happy to have some opportunity to introduce devotees to devotees, to introduce the family to the family and to the senior devotees and to the like the living active devotees. So it's not a one-way thing. Association is being together. And you can see so many of them here and from different places. And we can see so many here from different places. But with this way, we get to know each other. Like you were saying about Borun, now Bhimala Krishna. You, know, you met over Zoom before. And we already, and we met over zoom before when we when when we first when i first met him it's you know completely we know him we're not thinking oh uh, who, who are you you know yes i saw a passport photo of you or something no we already know quite a lot of their nature and so many things and by discussion so krishna mahaprabhu has given this technology so let us use it in his service Maharaj, we are yes. fully nourished by the your association, and that is the real food that we need. So we are not hungry. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, you are very kind, and we are all getting nourishment from each other. And really, we are getting nourishment from each other. We can, nobody can sit in a cave, especially in this age. I mean, a cave, metaphorically speaking, too. Nobody can be separate from the devotees, and it is good fortune when we can be with the devotees, as we've heard today. So we try our best to stay with the devotees also, and we are grateful that they, yourselves and others, make us welcome to, to be in the devotees' association. Hare Krishna. 
Anyway, for today, I think now we have to go to whatever the stage is that Rupa Goswami mentions in Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu, where we must part, but knowing that we will again meet soon. It does have a technical name. The whole science of like, moods of the all different stages of thinking, it's all very well known to Rupa and Sanatan. And in this world, you know, there is a science of psychology. You go to university to learn this, that, and the other. But everything, if we read uh, Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu, which means the nectar of devotion, if we read Srimad Bhagavatam, if we read Chaitanya Charitamrita, if we read Bhagavad Gita, we understand that everything about, you know, how we tick, what goes on, what we feel, it's all very scrutinizingly known. And what is the conclusion of all this knowing is that we have to be a devotee. We have to have a devotee association. We have to take seriously our spiritual life because we could easily be one of one million blades of grass right outside the window here. We could easily be all kinds of well, one of the, I hope it's not yet a million mosquitoes, but one of the mosquitoes, if I waking up for the summer but instead we've got a human body so and we've got this connection and wonderful association so i think this really to continue our spiritual life with faith and integrity if we can just keep reminding ourselves and how by having some sadhana by reading every day from what we should be reading from chanting our japa being with devotees so let us all do our best Wishing you a successful Saber Week and big jays to our masters, of course. Om Vishnu Parchi Lavakti Sunda Govinda, Dev Goswami Maharaj Ki Jai. Om Vishnu Parchi Guru Maharaj Shilavakti Rakhok Sridhar, Dev Goswami Maharaj Ki Jai. And Om Vishnu Parchi AC Bhakti Varanta Swami Prabhupada Ki Jai. Jai. Bhagavan Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Sarasati Thakur Ki Jai 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 Rupa Nuga Guru Vaga Ki Jai All the present day Sri Chaitanya Sarasati Acharya Vrinda Ki Jai Jai To all the devotees present Ki Jai or Ananta Kurti Vaishnava Vrinda Ki Jai 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 Gaur Premanandi Hari Ki Jai Sarasati Devi All of you one by one by one Ki Jai and my obeisances to you all Jai Shila Bhakti Ranjan Madhusudan Maharaj Ki Jai. Vancha Kalpatrubis Cha Kripa Sindhu. Burton Dubis Cha Patitanam Pavanem Vyo Vaishnam Vyo. And thank you all for making the devotees here also very lively and infused. You saw that you had, you had that effect on them. So we appreciate that. And myself. You made me infused too. Govinda Govinda